This is question 2 from paper 2 of the 2015 National 5 SQA Maths exam. We're given a function f of x equals 3x plus 2 and we're told that f of a is equal to 23 and we're asked to calculate the value of a. Now if we have a look at uh, what this function does, numbers that go into this function are multiplied with 3 and then have 2 added to them. So for instance, if we put 2 in, we'll get 3 times 2 plus 2. And if we put 5 in, we'll get 3 times 5 plus 2. It always multiplies by 3 and adds 2, whatever goes into it. Now in this case, we're not putting a known number in, we're putting an unknown number in, we're putting a in. So just as it does to normal numbers multiplies by 3 and adds 2 would do the same to a. We'll multiply a by 3, 3 times a plus 2. Normally just write that as 3a plus 2. So that's what comes out when a goes in. But we're told what comes out. We're told that when a goes in, 23 comes out. Well, we can't have two different things coming out of this function. These must be equal. So 3a plus 2 is equal to 23. Let's take 2 from both sides of this. Let's divide both sides by seven, by 3 and we'll get 7. So a is equal to 7. And we can just check that when we put 7 in to this function, multiply 7 by 3 and add 2, we'll get 21 plus 2 which is 23. That's what we're supposed to get. We're told that find the number a that goes into this function so that 23 comes out and certainly the number 7 does the trick.